these are my doggos. Ah! <laughs> Let's get to the drills. Well, hello friends. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Rissa and I'm obsessed with my doggos and diamond painting. And today we're here for another Small Business Saturday unboxing. So today, um, as you can see, I have a rather large package and this is actually another diamond painting to add to my collection. <laughs> and I wanted to give a special shout out to my sweet bean, my fiance, for getting this um, diamond painting for me and gifting it to me early for my birthday. I so appreciate it. I am going to go ahead and get into unboxing this now. So let me just go ahead and move Duke out of the way. Um, so this, this diamond painting today is actually from Robin and Ben over at Patty Wax. So yay, I'm very excited. I actually do have one other diamond painting from Patty Wax and that is Mama Bear that I unopen I unboxed in a other haul video. Um, and if you want to check that out, you can check that out. I'll link it down below. I love that painting. I am super excited about this one and it was one that when I saw it, I actually sent it to my fiance and I was like, like <laughs> I was sending it to him with like a inquisitive face emoji, <laughs> like uh, uh, basically just kind of wondering if I should get it. And um, he was like, ha ha. And um, later I was like, oh my God, I'm so upset because it's already sold, what the heck? And he sent me a screenshot and he was like, it's mine, ha 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 ha. <laughs> so I really just thought that was so sweet of him. Um, so it did come with some goodies taped to the top. Now, Patty Wax is also known as Distracted by Diamonds as well. They make Patty Wax um, wax for diamond painting as well as diamond paintings. So, in my last one, I got some dazzlers and stuff. So, I wonder how this will differ from the last kit that I got. So, last kit, I got um, some samples of wax as well. And it looks like I got... Uh, I actually got one sample of wax last time, but this time it looks like I got two. That's super nice. Super sticky wax and mango papaya. I'm going to smell this mango papaya real quick. Mmm, I love papaya. And these are so cute. Look at how they are shaped. It looks like a lion. <laughs> super cute. And then the super sticky, which I'm guessing doesn't have a smell. Yeah, it doesn't have a smell. But still super nice. I have not used the super sticky before, so I'm excited to give that a try. This is just a note from the owner or co-proprietor. <laughs> and um, this is just thanking us for the purchase and um, hoping that we come back again. And it also came with some really cute stickers. I love this one. And then this Ruth Bader Ginsburg, I think. Yes, RBG. And then um, a little candy, which I didn't get last time. Yummy. I love everything macchiato, so I'm sure I will love this. I'll probably munch on that later. We'll add diamond paint. And for the piece de la resistance, let me just move this stuff out of the way. <clears throat> The diamond painting, and today we're going to be unboxing Deep by Christina Belakova, and I just fell in love with this piece. Like, look at how beautiful she is with her ocean hair and her lotus flowers and the stars in her hair and her tattoo, which much reminds me of my tattoo, um, so I really love that, so I just find her really beautiful. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get this unboxed now. Okie dokie guys, we're gonna get to unboxing this now. I probably will have to end up moving you guys again because my table is far too small for doing full uh, panel panels of any of the canvases that I get, but we'll deal with that when we get there. So all of the Distracted by Diamonds 
painting kits um, come with this adorable heart tray um, <clears throat> that I have a couple of and then their own branded washi tape and then a heart shaped wax with a cover on the front of it so you will need to pull that off before you start diamond painting. I'm gonna unroll this so I can get the diamonds out and flatten her out. I got storage trays this time. I didn't get these the last time I got a Distracted by Diamonds kit. This is really cool. I haven't tried these containers before, but I have been wanting to try them. This will be really nice to be able to toss in my art dot container when I have my, like, a couple more colors than 60. So that's super nice. And then it did come with a little pen. But as you all know, I always just pull these extra pieces off and I recycle these and I actually keep these. Um, so <clears throat> that's what I'm going to end up doing with that. So we're going to talk about the piece first, then we're going to move the um, diamonds around and show you guys everything. So this is again Deep by Christina Belakova. It is 48 colors with um, no specialty drills, I believe. Um, I might end up swapping out um, some of the specialty drills in this kit. This is a round drill kit. And yeah, we're gonna get into the painting now. I'm gonna just take this and roll it the other way so it will flatten out the canvas a little bit quicker. It is a poured glue canvas, so doing that won't do anything to it. It will just help with getting this to lay flat a little bit quicker. And like I said, I'm gonna have to push you guys back probably and move you guys a few times to get the whole thing in frame. Just like, from the start this is humongous i didn't i'm gonna have to put the size in okay it's 62 by 87 centimeters okay 62 by 87 centimeters and i just always feel like i get sizes so wrong because i just really yeah i really didn't think that it would be this massive now don't get me wrong i'm obsessed with this this like just the rendering alone on that like on the canvas is so beautiful and you can tell that it's very well rendered. Like look at all the bits of her tattoo that are down here. I'm trying to get all of this as much as I can in, in frame for you guys, sorry about that. <laughs> but wow. <laughs> so my initial thoughts for this piece, again, I got the metallic drills for the um, unicorn piece that I did from Diamond Art Club by Pixie Sticks. And they are also round metallic drills. So my thought is maybe I'll swap out all of the stars that are gold in the sky for those. Or, and also maybe these bits in her, in her tattoo and her arrow. I guess maybe these are just stars. I'm not sure if these are tattoos or stars. It's kind of hard to, to tell, but I, I think they're just stars. So I'm thinking I swap out all of these for metallic drills and then maybe I add some like other glitter drills to maybe her hair in the darker points or something like that. Those are my initial thoughts because she, like she definitely needs a, a couple specialty drills because I do not believe that she has any. Looking over this bag of drills, I do not see any ABs. I'm not going to pull these out because they're all in baggies and I'm not going to be working on this anytime soon, so I don't want to have to um, bag these all up because they are matched to the schematic. So I do not want to uh, misplace any of the packs of drills before I start. So, but just getting a look at them, lots of, we have a lot of beautiful colors here. Lots of blues, lots of pinks. This is a really like nice, I feel like evenly balanced palette of colors. So we'll start at the top here. And she has just adorable lotus flower 
on the crown of her head that I just, I love so much. And from the reviews, I could see a few of the finished ones and I could, I could just, um, I could just tell it was going to be a really jaw dropping piece. So that's why I ended up snagging this one. So thanks to my fiance, of course. <laughs> And then, yeah, her hair is just this big wave of water. And I just really love how the lotus flowers are, are nestled in her hair. And like I said, her tattoos just really remind me of my tattoos. And I don't know, just everything about this piece, like it's tranquil and beautiful. And I don't know, I just, I feel really connected to this piece for some reason, guys. Like, I just really love it. Like, she's just so beautiful. And she's, of course, in space or what it seems like just in a night sky. But in her own galaxy, in her own world, it seems. Maybe that's why I feel very connected to this piece. I, I too, feel very much the same as her sometimes. But I, yeah, I'm obsessed with this piece, guys. Wow. I mean, like, I, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. What am I not, what am I not happy with the diamond painting, right? Well, there'll, there'll be a time, I'm sure, but it's not today. I am very, very thoroughly pleased with how this looks. Looking at the rendering up close, um, the drill field itself, like, it doesn't seem too large. The outline is not very bright, especially in all of these colors for her skin and everything. Um, I'm really excited to see how her skin tone translates in person. Uh, because, you know, that's really how you can tell, I feel like, with um, diamond paintings um, and, and how well they, they did the rendering is how well the, the body and the face turns out on it. So, yeah, I just am so in awe. This would have been a really good piece for Women Who Sparkle. I might actually have to save this one for next year. I have a lot of pieces right now, so... But, you know, you never know. She might end up getting picked. <laughs> you never know. But, yeah, guys, I just wanted to share this diamond painting that I got with you guys. Again, this is from Distracted by Diamonds. This is the piece Deep by Christina Belakova. And it is a licensed piece, so that means that um, the artist did give rights to Distracted by Diamonds to sell this. And they were compensated properly for their work which i love personally i have said in the past that you probably will not see a lot of content for non-branded diamond paintings here just because it's not my vibe but that is not to say that i feel negatively about anything or anyone who buys non-licensed things it's just that i personally will not be showing them on here um but enjoy the hobby how you can afford and how you like to that's really all that matters. And if you have the ability to support a small business um, of, of people that are just creating amazing things and, you know, bringing in more artists and more work from, uh, for the diamond painting community, you know, then please do that. It's a great way um, to support another small business and just a small shop in general. Um, I do believe that these are resin drills but please correct me if I'm wrong I'm not 100% certain on that I'm pretty sure these are resin I, I don't really know how to tell the difference and to be honest I, I don't really know if I care because I haven't done one that is acrylic I'm, I'm, I think I got the lingo wrong to be quite honest that's how much I don't really care about it like I'm just <laughs> I'm just doing it because I enjoy it guys <laughs> so I hope that was at least informal and informative for you my goodness words are hard to get out sometimes but I hope that was informative for you guys and that it helped you decide whether or not you might want to pick up this gorgeous beauty over at distracted by diamonds um yeah I'm gonna go ahead and get her packed up and probably head out for the day but I hope you guys enjoyed this short little small business unboxing Please leave a comment down below if you like these Small Business Saturday videos and if I should continue doing them. If you did stay to the end of the video, I so appreciate you for watching. Um, maybe you consider leaving a like on the video or subscribing to my channel for more diamond painting content in the future. Super appreciate you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.